Hey, what's up guys? I'm Mercy with DiscountLowVoltage.com and it's time for another product quick view. Let's get to it. Hey, today we're going to take a look at the Thermal Stripper by Fiber Fox. This is a fairly, fairly nice little tool if you strip a lot of jacketed fiber. If you do it often and you're tired of stripping, this will make it life a lot easier for you. And it, the bottom of it, that's where it charges. It takes a little power supply and charges fairly quickly. And then once it's charged, the manufacturer says that it'll cut, well, it'll uh, take the jacket off 500 times. So I'll show you guys how to use this here real quick. Uh, first, you want to turn on the heating stripper and set the right mode and temperature. So you want to go ahead and press that button right here. There we go. And you want to make sure that the heater's turned on right there. There we go. Now you can set the temperature, low or high. So far, I've played with this for quite a bit. I've always just left it on high. So the case is closed right now. That's why it keeps beeping and it feels a little warm. Uh, you can touch it if you want to see if it gets hot because I'm not gonna. But um, So the second thing you want to do, you want to go ahead and open both covers right here now one thing I do want to point out see right there that's where there's a kind of like a little sharp it sharpens a blade right there for you and it's the same thing on the other end so once you put it in there you squeeze it it'll hold it in place and then in the meantime you want to pull it off pull it this way and it'll strip that jacket off so I'll show you guys how to do that now keep in mind that the width right here it's good for single fiber or also ribbon fiber now you do have to use the fiber holders to buy fiber fox now this is for the 900 micron and there's also the 250 micron available so you want to go ahead and put that bad boy in there and, and it is magnetized too, so once it's in there, it's in there pretty good. You want to make sure it goes into place where it needs to go. Go ahead and close both sides. Press down on both sides until the light goes off. There we go, it's blinking. You want to go ahead and pull it apart. And there you go straightforward and that easy so if you do a lot of uh, maybe you got a fusion splicer and you have a stripper you're thinking about thermal stripper this is worth it or you do a lot of connectors just something to think about another tool into your toolbox and you know what they say about tools there isn't a man alive who couldn't use another one to order online visit discountlowvoltage.com